వెల్కమ్ గాయస్ తిరుమల ఈజ్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద బ్యూటిఫుల్ టౌన్ ఇన్ ద హిల్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ ఇండియా సరౌండ్ బై శేషాచలం ఫారెస్ట్ అండ్ లొకేటెడ్ ఎట్ త్రీ థౌజండ్ టూ హండ్రెడ్ ఫీట్ అబౌవ్ ద సీ లెవెల్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఫేమస్ ఫర్ లార్డ్ వెంకటేశ్వర స్వామి టెంపుల్ టు రీచ్ తిరుపతి వెదర్ యూ చూస్ బై రోడ్ ఆర్ బై అలిపిరి స్టెప్స్ ఆర్ బై శ్రీవారు మెట్లు ఫ్రమ్ తిరుపతి ఈచ్ రూట్ ఆఫర్స్ ఏ యూనిక్ జర్నీ ప్రొవైడింగ్ కామ్ అండ్ పీస్ ఫేకింగ్ యూర్ ట్రిప్ ట్రూలీ స్పెషల్ తిరుమల తిరుపతి దేవస్థానం ఈస్ ఆల్సో నోన్ ఎస్ టీటీడి ఈస్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద రిచెస్ట్ ఇండిపెండెంట్ ట్రస్ట్ అండ్ తిరుమల ఇస్ హోమ్ టౌన్ టు దన్ ఆఫ్ ద richest temple in our world every day many devotees visit the temple where each person undergo a biometric scan to get darshan tokens meanwhile some devotees wait in the queue to book accommodations on the other side security guards communicate throughout the day ensuring coordination for a safe and smooth darshan process without technology it is impossible for the tdd staffs to manage everything so in this video let us try to understand how technology play an important role from booking your darshan ticket to laddu counters using networking device తిరుమల తిరుపతి దేవస్థానం టీటీడీ వాజ్ ఫౌండెడ్ ఇన్ నైన్టీన్ థర్టీ టూ అండర్ ది టీటీ యాక్ట్ ఆఫ్ నైన్టీన్ థర్టీ టూ వల్ ఇట్ ఆపరేట్స్ అండ్ అన్ ఇండిపెండెంట్ ట్రస్ట్ స్టిల్ ఇట్ ఈస్ అండర్ కంట్రోల్ ఆఫ్ గవర్నమెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ టీటీడీ ఆపరేట్స్ విత్ అన్ వేరియస్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ రెస్పాన్సిబుల్ ఫర్ సర్వీసింగ్ సెక్యూరిటీ ప్రొడక్షన్స్ అడ్మినిస్ట్రేషన్ ట్రాన్స్పోర్టేషన్ అకామిడేషన్ అండ్ మోర్ బట్ అట్ ద టైమ్ దే డోంట్ హ్యావ్ ప్రాపర్ సెంట్రలైజర్ కోఆర్డినేషన్ విచ్ ఈస్ వై మోస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ద డివోటి బిల్ కన్ఫ్యూజ్ విన్ ద బిజీ టెంపుల్ దే డోంట్ హ్యావ్ ప్రాపర్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ ఆర్ గైడ్లైన్స్ అబౌట్ ద ప్రాసెస్ అండ్ సర్వీసెస్ ప్రొవైడెడ్ by the TDD because each department work independently. So to overcome this issue on October 9, 2010, the Chief Executive Officer of TDD, C.Y.R. Krishna Rao, has decided to integrate all of the departments for better services. They came up with the idea of providing a single Darshan token allowing devotees to access multiple services with single barcode. TDD collaborated with TCS to build a centralized website integrating all departments resulting the creation of Tirumala Tirupati Devasthanam official website tirumala.org where Tirumala represent the domain so now you can see a lot of services like booking darshan accommodation sevas not only services you can find latest updates and many more information in this centralized website let us try to understand how they integrated and how it works in my previous video i have clearly explained the importance of dns server connecting us to particular domain if anyone missed the video i have provided a link in the description for you to check out so whatever you're looking on the display means your system is connected to tdd web server here you can easily book your darshan tickets you can book your accommodations and save was by sitting in your home all you need is your id proof like your aadhar card or your passport to book your special darshan you need to log in with your registered mobile number to receive an otp which stands for one time password whenever a user request for otp tdd web server interact with the tdd otp server to generate a unique otp the otp server then generates a unique otp and send back to the tdd web server the web server then forward the otp to your mobile network if you are using jio it will forward to the jio network or if you are using airtel it will forward to the ATA network through the internet. Your mobile network then forward the OTP to nearby cellular towers and with the help of cellular models, your mobile device receives the OTP. Now you can enter the OTP in the TDD web server to complete the login process. But remember TDD use other various technology for OTP to keep it safe and secure. But in general, this is the common process for OTP generation and delivery. To book your Darshan ticket, navigate to special entry Darshan option. Upon selecting it, the TDD web server now interact with the TDD booking server. Because booking server is responsible for ticket reservation, availability and slot allocation for special entry Darshan. Then the booking server will communicate with the database to retrieve information. Once your detail match, it displays the availability for special entry Darshan on your computer screen with your green marks. Now you can choose your date and time according to your plan. TDD offers an amazing feature. With one registered mobile number, you can book up to six members at a time. When you choose this option, a detailed view will appear promoting you to enter information such as your name, your gender, age, and ID card details for each member. Once you have provided all the necessary details and complete the payment process by clicking confirm, your details are securely stored in the TDD database under this registered mobile number. By the same way, you can book your accommodation using your registered mobile number. However, this time the web server interact with the accommodation server because ticket booking and the accommodations are managed by the separate departments, right? So just like the ticket reservation, the details are securely stored in the same database under the same registered mobile number. 
Finally, your booking is confirmed. Check your email for booking status confirmation with the barcode and it's time to prepare for journey. Go for shopping, pack your bags and if you are a vlogger, open your camera and make a vlog traveling to Tirupati. But what about the people who are not able to book online? Here nothing to worry. In this case, they can book Darshan ticket at the Tirupati near Pudevi complex. Same process is applicable here. All they need a valid ID proof. They can show the proof to the working staff, then the staff member may take your biometric scan like your fingerprints and photos using fingerprint scanner and camera. Because there is a no such time to enter your details manually, instead of that they will collect your face and fingerprints to speed up the process and give you a Darshan ticket with the barcode and all your details are securely stored in his database. Now you have a valid Darshan ticket with the barcode. You can start traveling from Tirupati to Tirmala. When you are traveling from Tirupati to Tirmala, imagine it is like an exciting adventure. Whether you take by road is about 23 km or climbing the Alipiri steps is about 9 km or you choose the Srivaru Metlo covering 2 km, each path is filled with a unique feeling surrounded by beautiful hills and smoothing sound of the nature. And throughout your journey, you will notice the people around you singing Govinda Nama Swaranam creating a magical connection. This journey is not a trip, it is like a special journey for your heart. When you reach Tirmala, it is like a stepping into the busiest area, yet peaceful temple town. Everyone around you is immersed in the atmosphere of belief and spirituality. It is not more than just a place to visit. It is like going for a meaningful journey that touches your heart and soul. Now you have a two valid tickets with a barcode. One is for accommodation and other one is for special entry dashan. People who don't have accommodation tickets, they can find accommodation in any private hotels. Before dashan, whether you are heading for a accommodation checking or planning to go for a head shaving, you already have a barcode on your ticket. TDT staff stands at the accommodation or near the head shaving area, having a barcode scanner and computer along with him. If you choose to go for a head shaving, you can provide the dashan ticket to the staff. Then he will scan the barcode and the system will interact with the database. Once your detail match, you are allowed to proceed for the head shaving. Same procedure is applied for accommodation session. A TDD staff may scan your accommodation ticket. The system will interact with the database. Once your detail match, you are allowed to check in. After your initial process is completed, now it's time for darshan. TDD manages various of queues for devotees, including free darshan queues and special entry queues and more. And the same process is applied here. A TDD staff member stand in the front of the queue with barcode scanner avails you for darshan token. You can provide your darshan token to the staff, who will then scan the barcode and system will interact with the database and update the database that you have entered in the darshan queue. Throughout the queue, you will find many devotees with you all immersed in the devotion. Each person with a full of heart of devotion moving forward singing Govinda Nama Swaranam. Everyone has the same thought. When will we have our darshan? When we will see our Lord Venkateswara? Maintaining of the queue system to ensure smooth flow is quite challenging to the TDD staff and security guards. For this, they need coordination. Without coordination, it is not possible for the entire team to handle that situation. For this, they use walkie-talkie to coordinate. Most of the walkie-talkies usually communicate in a half-duplex mode, which means only one side at a time can speak. If both can speak at the same time through the walkie-talkie, it will fall under full-duplex mode. So with the help of full-duplex and half-duplex, security guards and TDD staff coordinate with each other for safe and smooth darshan process. As you approach the main temple, all staff members will signal you to open your eyes to see the divine presence of Lord Venkateswara. Once your dashan process is completed, you will definitely come with the goosebumps after seeing Lord Venkateshwara. Your tensions, your stress level, everything will be zero. Now it's time for collecting laddu. Same darshan token you can use for collecting your laddu. When you visit the laddu counter, the TDD staff will scan your darshan token barcode into the system. The system then interact with the database and if there is a match, you can obtain two laddus with one darshan token. So this is how centralized system is coordinated with each individual department. With a single darshan token, devotees can access multiple services. After two days, all of your details are removed from the database and they can reallocate to the new devotees, changing from red to green on their official website. I hope you got a clear understanding about the how TDD manages workflow. If you found this video informative, hit the like button and stay updated with me for my next video. Thank you. See you soon.